Hey guys, how's it going? Kriparian here. So one build that has eluded me uh, is just a crazy blaster build. And I've been trying to do this with, well, the one hero that can usually pull it off. Hopefully. I've been hoping anyway. Certainly a lot of hopium and copium involved on that one. Is Sneeds. Now Sneeds, buddy, is Battlecry copy of Death Rattle. The idea is you sell your first one and then you get like a golden blaster and then you put a bunch of hero powers on it and then you get a brand preferably a golden brand and then you battle cry when you use your second hero power you get two normal copies you battle cry one and then with the brand you battle cry the other and then those guys just explode the board like nothing you've ever seen before and you win the tie because it fills the board with a bunch of junk that's the dream it's never happened but today's video is as close as I've gotten it Funny enough, though, it was with Tess. Yeah, that's kind of the state of Battlegrounds right now. On the other hand, I like playing Tess, so I guess that's fine. Enjoy. Tess, easy. Ready to enter the tournament, champion? Why does it let me do that? I'm a little puzzled. You're gonna have to train that one up. Play your best out there. Is that how all games are released? Yeah, but not all games cost like $130 to play when everyone else is playing. And match. Need a drink? $130? That's how much the the most expensive one costs for me. You're a star Dude, in Brazil, it's like a, it's like a third or a quarter of minimum wage. I've actually received many like private messages and stuff. It's like I'd really like to play, but uh, it's just an unaffordable game. There's no way I could be playing in this early access beta. <laughs> quarter, third. Yeah, I wasn't sure if it was a third or a quarter. But, uh, basically it's a lot. Ready to I think I'm going for this one and then, like, selling two. A one-man army! <laughs> it's been in Venezuela, it's like a third. No, oh, Venezuela is two months' salary. So if, if you're curious why why games are so expensive um, on Blizzard's end, is because uh, China gave Blizzard the boot. And what happened is a lot of Chinese players um, still want to play Blizzard games. And Chinese players are actually pretty internet savvy. So they use VPNs to play them. So within like two weeks of China booting out Blizzard, uh, Blizzard dropped their region-based pricing on their on all their Hearthstone products, and I believe all their products as well. Actually, don't want his buddy. His buddy is awful. I'm just gonna get these two. A quarter for the base game, a third for I've Ultimate Edition in Brazil. You yeah. Well, I, I guess, you know, what I remembered was roughly correct. the rest of my life effect when new games come out. How's the game go? Happier when you're shopping kind of thing. Oh, that's a nice one. This will pack a punch. Um, I like I like tr like learning games and trying to figure them out, especially if they have complex systems, especially if they're of a genre that I like. But 
it's pretty hard to like stream every day for more than one week at a time. Um, just like physically, it's hard to do that, even if even if you really want to. And we have like a lot of things going on in our life all the time. So to kind of, you know, step aside and not have to do any of that doesn't really work a lot of the time. No third. Uh, I kind of like it. I think it's fine. I think a medal is in your future. Oh my god, I just got a brand. Let's go. Chasing Auroras. I mean, that doesn't take that much time. Usually. Okay, see you. You'll have to train that one up. Who knows what secrets will uncover? What is that? Yeah, that one too. Okay. Talking about quarter and a third somewhere in the US many years ago when McDonald's showed up with a quarter pounder, a different burger chain made a third pounder and it failed because Americans thought a quarter pounder was bigger than a third pounder. Score. You are good. Well, one over three versus one over the four. The four is bigger, ain't it? Not wrong. What are you going to tell me? Another chain is going to do something as idiotic as sell like a half pounder? <laughs> Good luck with that. Pretty nice, pretty nice. She sells seashells. She sells seashells. been keeping score. You are good. What? Hard didn't exactly die first. I got like no minion types right now.
Yeah. My quest begins here. Can't stop a good weed. Can't you see? What feeling clutching? Leroy Jenkins. Time to hustle. Hitting that, is it? That one plays well. Good pick. Take a deep breath. Move along, chump. Guys, nothing. I am starting to get pretty bored. Play your best out there. Some champions. Take a deep breath. Gotta trade them out now and then. That was a pretty big power spike, but it's turn 10. This is not amazing for turn 10. Coca-Cola swapping sugar for corn syrup. Yeah, that's only in the US though. They don't allow that stuff anywhere else. And um, Coke Zero is much better anyway, in my opinion. I think a medal is in your future. Caramel sweetened beverage enjoyer of the world. Except in the US. I think all the. All the corn syrup just makes it taste weird to me. And, and maybe I'm just not used to it, but I, don't, I just don't like it that much. So 
So, what's the score? Holy crap. Take a deep breath. Holy crap. Kinda like that one. Just sold an ice block. I don't think I can afford the lower stats. It's really hard to scale that given what I have on uh, how board locked I am. your coin. friend. Wow, the card sucks. Dude, that is not how you play that. Train that one up. The odds are in my favor. She sells seashells. Really hard. Important job gets special bomb. So this one copies this one. And this one copies this one. Now we sell that one. 
get a big one that copies this one. Yes, that's correct. Good play. Here's your coin. Text quiet. I probably, probably don't need extra battle cries anymore. Is Felbat? I mean, it'll take too many turns to scale up properly. Sometimes you gotta make tough calls on the feet. All right, let's go. Oh, his golden one made it? What kind of BS was that? Oh, man. Yeah, I'd lose. Looks like I'm not gonna die, at least. He has a Baron, which is pretty interesting. A strong one for your team. Gotta trade him out now and then. Um, just Sriracha. It's fine, thank you. I don't know if I want to do Selfless. I think I don't want to do Selfless. Gotta get taunt on this thing though. I think a medal is in your future. Hmm? No, no, it's fine. Bombing. Bum, 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 bum. She's impressed, guys. I had a smile. A smile was cracked. May have even gotten it on video in a reflection. I'd lose anyway. Oh crap. I just gotta dodge the poison, my biggest card, and I, I think it's fine. I think, I think it's fine. Yep. Oof. Okay, Ice Block is down. I finally get the ghost here. Wait, that's a pretty big card. What a play! Two random secrets, huh? Kind of sick. I kind of like it. Kind of like it. Practice makes perfect. to recruit some champions. Uh, uh, let me try again. A 
to lose the ghost 100%? What are you talking about? I think a medal is in your future. You're not losing to that. Big Bomba. And the crowd goes wild. That was a good play. That one plays well. A strong one for your team. Need Golden Baron? Yeah, but right now I just need to scale my stats up. So. Is the only counter to this just even bigger stats? Well, Anixia with the Death Rattle tiebreakers and the insanely large uh, Death Rattle minions. Um, Unfortunately, he's actually got a build that is uh, not very bad against mine. However, if I don't die, I will get a triple Baron, and the Tavern stat buffs will come into effect here. So, yeah, it's uh, it's going to look really good. The Reborn counters me. We'll see. If I don't die. I mean, I think it said 20 last time, but yeah, it's not... It's not exactly easy to compute. Uh, we can get Ice Block also. We have Redemption, so we'll get a second Street Magician if we attack first, which is very good, obviously. This is my favorite sport. Kill the Baron. Yes, just barely. Or, or not just barely. Wait, why did that come back? Yeah, those are pretty tough to beat here. It's just so many. Did I get Ice Block though? I did! I don't know if Triple Baron is gonna work very well though. I guess cards are dying anyway. I think Triple Baron might be a debate. So, It'll just nuke my own cards harder. I think the Street Magician might be done also. Good play. Here's your coin. He sold that card. Okay. in your future. Now the 
triple baron is not, not good. This whole board dies anyway. I'd like to play it, but it's just not a good idea. Next turn, my baron will survive. with the only build that really counters me outside of having like 400 stats. If I got a golden selfless, it would have not just been a very powerful death rattle, but it would have um, given me an extra double. And if I got an extra double after that, it would have made the Baron live. So I would have gotten uh, four divine shields instead of one and an extra minion which would have won just to be clear i was trying to go ham to get a triple one of these guys or a triple selfless and i got neither but if we got either one so oh i could have sold the baron in my hand to buy the his baron oh interesting interesting that that may have actually uh, been enough maybe 